I probably did. Can't recall. Well, it's not here, so... Oh, this is repaired already, duh. Since it was near the border, I probably already prioritized it before going to the restroom. But usually when you capture the, the air bases, they're all damaged. This one was an exception or I already repaired it. Okay, good. Is obsolete now. So the next CB is going to go away when. Thirteen of July. But we have one, another one against Argentina, 28. Let's just find another one. Strategic, these strategic bombers, they take their sweet time to arrive. Those strategic bombers level 1? They probably are. Nope, level 2. But I cannot reach that. So 335 people, 1000 people, let's see if it drops. Nope, has no effect over population, which would be a, um, very interesting to see. I mean, it would have even more strategic effects. this new system, I really do. It's stupid, time consuming, everything. Hearts of Iron Tree, I picked a freaking fleet. With one command, the fleet would rebase and move. Now I need to tell it to rebase and I need to tell it to move. Twice the amount of clicks, twice the amount of work. 
You can think of things like, hey, it's just two clicks. Yeah, but if you think proportion, if you think the way that I'm thinking, it's 100% more work to do the same. In a game like this, it all it all adds up to a gigantic amount of clicks at the end of the campaign. Naval invasions take like 400%, 500% more clicks than in Hearts of Iron Tree. Imagine managing the fleet takes, I don't know, 300% more clicks. Imagine managing the air force takes 500% more clicks or more. It's it's unbelievable. I guess there is still room for another drop. Yay! You now know how to build carriers. This is all useless now. Let's research rockets, whatever. Yep. Finding the fleets already takes 500% more time. They are not in the ledger. Yeah. Unless you consider this a ledger. Which is not. So. We had the ledger with everything aligned over here. That took like 10% of the space this, this crap is taking. This is not even transparent. This is completely blocking my view of 20% of the map, give or take. Yeah, this is this is blocking like 20% of the map. It's just it's who found who thought this was a great idea. I don't know, but it doesn't matter. It does this this is blocking the map. The the, the previous ledger had we could have ev we could have everything. It's small letters, didn't block the map. We click it, we go towards the fleet. Now, if I want to find the freaking fleet, I need to click here. One click, two clicks. Whatever. Okay, let's focus. What are these dudes doing? 29 days. These guys are still moving towards Iceland. These guys are getting to their position. The fleets, where are they? These ones are still... in supporting... The dudes in Japan. What the fuck are you still doing here? Sometimes they don't move. Sometimes they don't move, they, 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 they're stuck.
Okay, just move, you need to regain organization. And go over there. Probably a waste of nukes to bomb through. Because I doubt they are gonna surrender if they don't lose their capital. So that, that was probably a waste of good nukes. Bolivia should be easy to defeat. Let's work on it straight away. <laughs> She'll send troops over there. Yeah, I could use another... Okay, let's stop this headquarter. Just stop. Just stop. Bring these guys closer just in case we may be able to use the use them to para drop something. We never know. Where are my transports? It's for me. It's, it I'm very used to Hearts of Iron and other st strategy games, paradox strategy games, and it's still hard to find the air bases. I know it's here. If it for me it's clearer to use these map modes to actually find the air bases instead of the air base instead of the strategic air map mode. But if I do so, it unselects my 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 fight my airplanes. You're welcome, Jazz. See you later. Okay, let's cross. Could use an, a nuke here. To speed this up, let's do so. nukes against Brazil. Sixth of July. Let's create another plan. Yeah, 
see we can if we can pull this off. If we if we can't, it will be due to lack of range of the destroyers. And I can already see it. They don't have the range. At least not for this this place. Seven days, and we'll have the range to go take out the Free American Empire or whatever they're called. Free American Empire. Yay, we captured an airbase. Is this wrecked? Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be wrecked, even if there was no fighting? So, that. Let me check. I don't understand. Around zero airplanes, is this in my hand or not? Yeah, they're damaged. It's just a pain in the ass to find us the, the things here due to not being in alphabetical order. Okay, whatever. Let's improve the airbase. Oh, this is called. This is a. This has a different name. I'm building in the wrong place. Probably I cannot build here. Whatever. Let's prioritize it just in case we need it for Argentina. is saying can you sort on location and isn't the air base on the state not the province yes the air base is built at the state level which is nonsense but again if you're watching this you think hey this guy is very negative 
This guy doesn't like the game. Why the fuck is he playing it? Yes, I really like the, I like the game, but I have I I have you know I have my opinion of things that are not well, not good, can be improved. That's why I, I talk too much. So in the last stream, I took this province, wanted an airbase, proceeded to build, proceeded to build one. Do you know? Do you want to know what happened? My engineers were building the airbase to level 10 behind enemy lines over here. You know why? Because this state, this huge state, already had an airbase. Because it already had an airbase, and I only control this one. My en my engineers were actually building this airbase to level 10 behind the enemy lines and sometimes we are prevented from actually building an airbase in a state where there is already an airbase so you're telling me that the state of this size gigantic size can't have more than one airbase lots of nonsenses One of the viewers even, even, I can't recall which one said it, but I thought it was funny. He advised me to shot, to, to, to put my engineers in front of a firing squad. Because they were helping the enemy with a build up a level 10 airbase. Four days until this is possible. Okay, I'm gonna see again if I missed something. Green India is dead. Main Cuckoo is dead, despite what you're seeing here. Siamese Empire is dead, I think. These guys are not a major power, but I still wanna take them out. Where is my fleet? You're supposed to be over here. You are. So the dudes are gonna. Another inconsistency. Inconstant. Inconstancy with um, this game is whenever we want to add multiple stuff to the to multiple orders, we can queue them by holding shift. Over here, if we hold shift, it doesn't work. But uh, yeah, we only need to add another one. the dudes they're almost there let's give them a battle plan okay we're nearing one of their VPs. Bolivia is gonna go down pretty soon.
Well, if we don't drop a nuke here, we won't be able to take them out that soon. Because they have a very high national unity. Just five. This is probably only worth very few VPs. Well, we are going to have to overrun them. Not a big deal. Okay, the fleet has arrived. Let's tell it to patrol those two areas. Should be plenty for um, to do this and maybe this one too. Let's check it. Tough luck. South Central Atlantic. Maybe if we detach the level trees, the level trees and level twos, we can actually do this. I don't know, it's a long shot, but it might work. It's a long shot because destroyers have very poor range. This one. Yay, we can probably do it. I don't know what's going to be the efficiency. But let's see what happens. Nah. Yeah, it was a long shot. 